With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students. So the question is, a particle moves in XY plane under the action of force such that its linear momentum at any time t is t vector equals to 2 cos t i cap plus 2 sin t j cap. The angle between the force and the momentum at any given point of time is. So this question is based on the chapter laws of motion. Here we know that force is given by dp over dt. That is rate of change of momentum. That means if we differentiate the momentum with respect to time. That is 2 cos t i cap plus 2 sin t j cap. Now on differentiating here we get the differentiation of cos is minus sine. So it becomes minus 2 sine t i cap plus 2 cos t j cap. This is equals to force. And we have to find the angle between force and momentum. So what we do, we do the dot product of force with momentum. Momentum is given here in the question and force we have find out. So we simply do the dot product minus 2 sin t i cap plus 2 cos t j cap to the dot product with 2 cos t i cap plus 2 sin t j cap which on further here we get what we do in dot product simply multiply the coefficients of i cap so it will become minus 4 sin t cos t and next with j cap we get plus 4 sin t cos t. So cancel out it will be 0. So that means the dot product of force with momentum is 0. Which implies that the force is perpendicular to the momentum. Which on further suggests that theta is equal to 90 degrees. So that means the correct answer of this question is option 4 pi by 2 that means theta is equal to 90 degrees. I hope that answers your question. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.